Hi besties! Welcome back to my channel. I hope you are all having a wonderful day. Today we're gonna do, of course, what would we, of course, we're gonna do a Timu haul. I mean, what else would we do here, right? So, uh, yeah, just got this bag the other day. Of course, it's probably very, very random, so let's get into it. Um, what else would I say? Oh, today, I mean, I'm uploading this on whatever day. <laughs> Whatever day you're watching this, I want to say happy birthday to Simply Jessica Marie. Happy birthday, friend. Also, um, if you guys could check out Gigi's Craft Attic and Halls. She is very, very close to 2,000 and like, th like this, this close, like this much. So if you could please go check her channel out. Um, she's doing some Timu hauls that you absolutely should not miss and she is a great gal as well. Uh, so just want to shout out those couple of people right off the bat. Also, let's say a little prayer and safe travels to our friend over at Hey Everybody. Let's, hi, Aaron. Happy and safe travels. We're so excited you're going to Japan this weekend. What? Okay. Anyway, let's get, now that that's out of the way, let's get on to the haul. Um, okay. Again, this is going to be a lot of random, random randomness. Okay, uh, first up are these wig, plastic wig bags. Um, they, I think there's, how many's in here? There's five. Okay, so most of you, if, if you're new here, hi, welcome. Um, if you are new here, please, please subscribe if you would be so inclined. Or give me a like if you like Timu Halls. I'm happy to have you here. If you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. So, uh, if you don't know, I am a full-time wig wearer. I have some hair loss, so I always wear wigs. So you may come back one day and you may be like, wow, this girl was really blonde the other day and her hair was kind of long. And then the next day it could be something else. So <laughs> I like to buy these wig bags because most, ba most wigs I get are in a box and they take up a lot of room in the closet. So I bought these wig bags. You get a five, five pieces of these. So they all come with their own hanger. So you get these hangers right here and then the bags. So this is what the bags look like and they are super thick. You could put lots of things in here. I think you wouldn't necessarily have to put wigs in here, but they have a little sleeve right here. If you want to put the wig tag in there or write the color and style name and kind of slip something in that pocket, they have like a, it's almost like a Ziploc bag thing on the side here and then you just open it up and put your wig in here and this is where the uh hanger comes in you put your hanger in here you put your wig on the hanger the hanger goes inside of the bag and up through the top and your wig hangs on there so yeah pretty cool bags really nice very 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 uh tough bags they're very well made but you could put all kinds of things in here probably if you didn't want to put wigs um the bags are great um i like to put my wigs in these only because if you have like a house like mine where it might be a little bit i mean sometimes we get some dust floating around every now and then and this way it'll keep your wigs from getting dust on them or drying out um i've even been known to put my wigs into ziploc bags to keep them from drying out yeah very strange i know but it works okay Next up, this is another weird item. <laughs> kind of weird. Well, I might not be weird. I don't know. I, it's it's a literal, like, a hard mouse pad. And it was $8.98. Oh, my gosh. But here's the thing. So, I like to sit on the couch and be on my laptop. And I don't have a mouse. I think I bought a wireless mouse, which actually might be in this bag. But I wanted a hard, a hard mouse pad. It's just, like, a rose gold. I think this came in, like, different colors. But it's metal. I just wanted a hard thing to sit my mouse on while I'm on my computer on the couch. You know, I don't like those. I mean, I like the other mouse pads that are soft, but this way, if you're on like a flat, like a comfy surface like your couch, you can sit it on there. So it was $8.98. Not sure if that's like the greatest deal or not, but I like it. It's like rose gold. It's just metal. It's just like a piece of metal. I probably could use a book, but hey, I had to be bougie and buy something, I guess. Okay. Actually, let's let's open this next. It's a ring. So, because it matches my outfit a little bit, so I'm going to wear it the rest of the haul. But, um, so this is an adjustable ring. It didn't come in any sizes. It did come in a couple different uh, color variations, but this is what she looks like. 
it's got kind of like a tri-metal type effect that looks like there's some like silver or some rose gold on gold but it's stretchy and i think i'm gonna have to wear it on my middle finger but i love it i think the other color that they they had in this was like a uh pastels maybe i might get it because i really like it and you can wear it on probably any finger but my you know i mean i could wear it on this finger it's a little too big for my ring finger you know, like it's going to slide off. So I'm either going to have to wear it on my middle finger or my pointer or even my thumb. But I don't, I don't like to, no, I don't like to wear rings on my thumb. I don't know. But anyway, I thought it was really pretty. I really like it. I usually don't go for the gold, but yeah, I thought it was nice. $2.99. Heck yeah. Love it. Okay. Then I got this item. It's like the frownies. It was $1.74. Now I was reading the ad of this the other day. And it said they're reusable, so it's a piece of silicone. It's a piece of silicone, and you put it on your forehead, you know, like right here. And you can wear it to bed or whatever. And I'm guessing you could probably put some, like, skincare underneath it or something like that. And so, yeah, you just kind of leave it on there for a while. You take it off, wash it, and then you can reuse it. So I love that it's reusable for $1.74, and I have some forehead lines going on, so definitely going to try this. I'll let you know if it works. If it does work, then woohoo! Going to lo love it if it actually works. Okay. Let me take this out of here. All right. This was $5.94. And I, I'm glad that I am opening this because I actually just put it in my cart again because I didn't think I bought it. And you guys are probably going to think this is like super weird. Okay. But it was six bucks. All right. And what it is, is it is a. Hold on, let me get it out of the bag here. It's a stand that you open up to put your foot on. So like when you paint your nails or you're doing a pedicure or something like that. Looks like this. And you just kind of open it up. If I can open it up. There you go. You can adjust it to however you'd like. If you want it like taller. You know what I mean? Like you put your foot on it. As you're painting your toenails. Because I'm always like trying to cramp up. You know, like trying to paint my toenails and sticking my foot on my chair and all that so I thought it was kind of cool and it's adjustable so you can adjust it to like whatever height you need or if you want it flatter or you want it more taller or however you want to do it and then it came with these little like toe things too <laughs> these look a little strange but we're gonna look at them they feel really weird oh gosh oh the texture is almost ah the texture is almost killing me I think you put your toes in here and it separates them. Oh my gosh. They're silicone, but oh, they feel so weird. Oh my gosh. I don't know. I don't know about these. Very strange feeling. I'm a texture fanatic. Like I can't even eat certain food, foods because of texture. So, but yes, yeah, so you get these little toe, two toe spreaders and then this for like six bucks. And I was like, heck yeah. Cause now I can post my foot up on here while I'm painting my toenails. Or whatever because you know it's summer and I need to paint these toenails let me tell you they need painted pretty bad so I like that it's when you set it down it's like you know yeah I like this for six bucks heck yeah I've seen the more expensive on there and then it just folds down and there you go so love that awesome awesome thing okay um, next up are these I think there's another set of these in here somewhere but anyway these were a dollar seventy seven they are like paper clips for the ends of like your reports and stuff and I like to use these instead of staples um so yeah they're just like little clips that you kind of like open up put your papers in there and then you can still like fold your paper so I mean they're they're okay they're not like super duper strong or anything but you know sorry the cat's over here playing if you can hear him I don't know what he's into but yeah they're all clear and then I think you get like 10 of these if I remember correctly, I don't know. Yeah, 10 pack. A 10 pack for $1.77. So, yeah. Just paper. They're kind of like paper clips. Only for the cut for the corner. Alright, this is another wig bag. This was $2.09 for this wig bag. Now, this one is not plastic. It's like a it's like that material you sometimes get the shoe organizers in. But I just kind of wanted to see what it was like. You get the standard hanger. Here's what the bag looks like. Um, and then the hanger goes in. You have to open this thing up first. So let me open it. 
you unzip it. Well, I just zipped it, not unzip it. You unzip it. You stick the hanger on the inside. If I can get it in there, it's going to come out the top. You stick your wig on the hanger or whatever. I'm, I'm assuming once the wig is on here, these hangers will not slip out. And then you just zip, zip it up. But you can put all kinds of things in these bags if you want. But yeah, so this is like just another idea for your wig storage. Um, so yeah, 209 for this. It's not as hefty as those other plastic ones I showed in the beginning. That one isn't, it's, I mean, it'll last, but it's not as well made as those full plastic ones. Alright, I got a few tank tops in here. Here's two of the three, or maybe this is the third one. They were all kind of the same, but different colors, but they were $7.47 for these. And I always wear, in the summer, like, my signature outfit is, like, distressed jeans, a tank top, and a kimono. And that's, like, my summer outfit for the entire summer. Or I'll switch it up and wear capris. I very rarely wear shorts. Um, so I'm hoping these fit. Now, I got these in a... I wasn't sure what size to get. Like, I wasn't sure, should I go bigger? Should I... I don't know. So I got them in a 4X, which uh, might be a little too big. So I'm kind of hoping that they shrink up. Well, I might not. I mean, I can still wear them. They're very, very stretchy. Look at that. I mean, super stretchy. And it has this, like, um, what do I want to call this? Like the, someone help me out. Like a, there's kind of see-through. So I'm, I don't know. Like, I might have to wear, like, a nude color bra underneath it. But super stretchy. I probably could have sized way down. Um doesn't say what they're made out of polyester I'd assume but they are a little bit see-through but I love this color green so yeah it'll be they're very nice I can tell it's not gonna like cling to my parts my body parts they're very very well made I mean for seven bucks for seven dollars I, I really like those so yeah 747 I think is what they were 747 so there's that one now, I'm not super crazy about this blue, but I thought, well, I'll find something to wear with it. It's like a sky blue, but I don't know. Like, do you think it will look, like, do you think it will look good with my coloring? You know? I always wanted to do one of those, you know how those, do you ever watch those, uh, color things where the people hold up the colors and be like, are you a spring? Are you a fall? What are you? Like, I have no idea what I am. No idea. But yeah, this is like a very, very light sky blue. Um, not sure it matches me so much but again it's like they're kind of see-through so again I'm gonna have to wear like a bra uh, like a nude colored bra so yeah but very very stretchy and very very comfy for sure okay is this the same thing or something different 747. I think it's the same thing only in black. I every time I get find something I kind of like, I get it in like every single color. So here it is just in black. I always get a black tank top. Can't not get a blank tank. This one kind of stinks. And I don't know why, but yeah. The armholes don't feel like too big either, like like your boobs aren't going to like hang out the sides or anything like that. But yeah. So, yeah, I love black. Like I feel like black is my color. I'm a winter, <laughs> I'm a winter gal. Is black a winter color? I don't know, I would assume. But you see how it's like see-through, kind of? But they're very stretchy, very, very stretchy, very well made. They feel very, like they would be super comfortable and not clingy, which I love. So yeah, super love that. I don't like clingy clothes. Okay, I bought this pair of earrings. I feel like I bought some of these for a swap. I won't say who, because I got a couple swaps coming up. But they were $2.48, and they had these in a bunch of different colors. Um, yeah, let me get them out of the package. Okay, $2.48 for these. I got them in the color white. But look how pretty these are. Look how pretty. They just, like, they're kind of shimmery, and they've got, like, the white beads at the bottom, and then they go up into a silver. I just thought they were so pretty. Like... I love having just an earring that catches a little bit of light. It's so pretty. It will literally take 10 years off your face. Not even kidding. If you have like just some kind of earring that will catch people's attention. But yeah, absolutely love these. I think they're adorable. I, I wish I, I might get these in other colors. Like I think they had like a really pretty turquoise. 
But yeah, how cute are those? I love those. $2.48 for those. Definitely will be wearing those. Um, wait, here's another one of those bags. You can buy them single too. So a single one is $2.49. I got a five pack for $10. So same exact thing. It was just a single bag. Oh, I did buy a mouse. So when I go upstairs, I'm going to connect my wireless mouse to my computer. This was free. I got this free. I don't know how that happens. Um, it might have been because I'm in Timu Circle, which I think I'll do a video about Timu Circle at some point. My hair is stuck in my glasses. Um, because I feel like different people get different things. I I'm not sure, but... Anyway, this is one of my free items. You get two, I get two free items a month with Timu Circle, Timu Circle. Plus I get um, coupons and like special deals. And then you get like so much cash back on every order. So I don't know, for me it's worth it. Like, so yeah, I got this free. Um, it's just a wireless mouse. Um, or is it a wired mouse? No, it says wireless. Oh, here's the little, there's a little, you know, whatchamacallit right here. I gotta get it out though. Come on. The little hickey madoodle thingy majigger. It goes like in the bottom. I, why can't I think the USB thing? So yeah, just got that from, so I'm gonna use that with my mouse pad and that should help me edit my videos a lot faster because I usually like, I'm usually like on my, uh, <laughs> on my uh, keyboard, like doing this with the mouse thing. It takes me forever to do things. So yeah, that'll be, that'll, Quicken things up for sure. Okay, here's more of those clips. These were 79 cents for five. And these are the same clips as I showed you, except for these are just in different colors. So they came in, I got like two blue and a yellow and a clear and then a purple. And they're just clips for the tops of reports and stuff like that. So that's all those are. I'm gonna take those to work with me. Wow, I'm flying through this bag. Slow down, Jen, take a breath. Take a breath. I talk really fast. I'm sorry. I don't know why I do that. It was so funny because one time we... I mean, I'm from Western Pennsylvania. And so I don't know if since I live in the North, like, do we talk really fast or something? Because I remember one time, like, years ago when I was a teenager, I went down South. Like, I think we were in Memphis. And uh, I had... went. We went into McDonald's to order something. And I went to order and the girl's like, wait, what? <laughs> like, I was talking way too fast for her. Maybe it's just me, though. I don't know. Anyway, these were 67 cents. They're the little face hair removal thingy, thingy -ma bobbers. Um, but 67 cents for all of these. And you get, like, five of them. And, yeah, they just got, like, the little... I use these all the time for my face, eyebrows, all the things. So, yeah, 67 cents. I thought that's not a bad deal, you know. You, these are way more expensive in the store, so can't beat that for 67 cents. Oh, wait, what's this? I also got earbuds for my computer, too. These were $6.47. I always get these off of Timu. I've gotten several pairs of wireless earbuds. I've got several pairs of wireless headphones, charging cords, all of the techie stuff for my phone or my laptop or my Android tablet, all of that stuff. I'm telling you, you cannot beat the price on these. $6.47. Um, they're wireless. And you get, you know, a set of the little ear things. Here's your charging cable. And here is the little pod they come in. And you open it up. Whoops. And there they are. I wonder if there's any charge in them at all. There must be. Yeah, I went to take them out. And it says 70%. So it'll tell you how much they're charged or when they're charging. It lights up. It's a really cool little case. Like, come on, six bucks for this? I mean, that's pretty awesome for that, you know? I'm just saying, like, so I'll take them upstairs and get them all charged up. Uh, and yeah, I'm, my, I'm gonna be rocking on the laptop tonight. I got a new mouse, some ear, ear pods, some, geez. I'm like a whole new woman. Okay, I got more of these little eye shaver things. These were $1.17 for three. The other ones were a better deal for sure. But these look different. They're like smaller, like tinier at the top. They're like covered. They put these covers on them so you don't cut yourself. And then it's like a little wee tiny little razor. Like literally, you know? Yeah. Very, very tiny. But I, I go through these so quick. Like, 
I'm always taking hair off my face. I very rarely pluck anything on my face. It just takes too long. I like to hit it with the razor and move on with my day. Okay. Then I got this item. It was $1.67. Oh, I got some of these for friend mail for somebody too. Or in a swap, but I won't say who. They are the essential oil patches. And they are in lavender. Yeah, lavender. Just lavender. Um... What do you do with these? I assume you just put wear these like at night. It's like a nighttime type of thing. So you can, maybe it's supposed to help you sleep. I, I don't know. Supposedly, maybe anyways. But this is what they look like. Essential oil patches. Um, let's see if it says anything. Before use, please carefully read the instructions. Okay, well, what are, where are the instructions at? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I assume you just kind of put it on your skin. Directions for... Wow, those those words are so tiny, even with my glasses. Anyway, they're just oil patches. Little essential oil patches that look like this. Let's let's sniff one. Or let's see if they're like... What are they? Do you put them on your skin? I don't even know. Oh! So that whole little patch smells and it's like a sticker on the back. Maybe you could put it... I don't know if I would put these on my skin. Would you? Do you put them on your skin? They're not super smelly. They smell good. They smell good, but maybe you could, like, put one on your pillow at night or, you know, maybe on your shirt, like your bed shirt. Yeah, I don't know if they go on your skin, and I can't... Those words are so tiny on here. I literally, I literally cannot read that. I have no idea what that says. So tiny. But, yeah. So, I don't know how many. There's 28 in here for $1.67. Or, you know what you could do is even dribble a little bit of essential oil on these, too. Like, if you don't, if you want, like, to mix two cents or something, just dribble a little bit on the patch, too. But, yeah, I, I doubt they go on your skin. Right? I, I don't know. Maybe they do. Maybe they do. Okay. Let me dig deep here. Ooh! Nails! These were $3.98, and I love these. I feel like I've got these before. I feel like I hauled these before, but I love the, the color of these. Like, OMG. Look at these. Look at those. Wow. Like, depending on which way you look, they're like, oh, they're orange. Then they're green. Then they're like, wow, it's like a whole vibe, isn't it? Wow, I love those. $3.98, I got them in a size large, which I hope they're not too big for my fingernails, but I absolutely love those. The color shift on these is great. It's like orange, but it's pink, but it's blue, but it's gray, but it's, oh, it's all the things, yeah. Love those. $3.98 for those. And the, the, um... The handmade nails are always more than, than other nails, but well, well, well worth it. It's literally like having a set of acrylics on. I put these on today, and I actually used the glue tabs that came in the box from Timu. I hauled these, I don't know when. I thought, well, they kind of match my shirt. And I thought, well, I, since I have to, like, paint my deck, it's Memorial Day weekend. So since I'm probably going to paint the deck or do some type of planning, I didn't want to, like, I got hair everywhere. I didn't want to glue any nails on because I'm like well I don't want to start digging and then but aren't they pretty I think they're great I think they're great okay last but certainly not least I got this mug <laughs> that I'm going to take to work with me it was $6.29 for this mug it comes in this really cute box that says sweet love all over it so okay <laughs> wait till you guys see this it's Maybe you can relate if you have a job like mine. You're going to relate. So $6.29 for this. It's this little dumpster fire dog. And it says, it's fine. I'm fine. Everything's fine. And it's on both sides. But yeah, I, I have like stickers and stuff of him. Or I, I'll send a meme to some people at work. <laughs> it's like the dumpster fire dog. Like his whole office is on fire. Yeah, that's definitely me for sure. No doubt. I'm going to take that to work with me get everybody to have a good laugh out of that so yeah well that was everything in my haul for today and 
yeah, that's it. So if you would like to, please subscribe below or give me a like. Leave me a comment. Um, tell me what your favorite item was. My favorite item was probably these nails. I love these. I'm not sure. There was a lot of good stuff in there, I think. I know, super random, but all right. Anyways, I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.